Hi, we are Group 6 of San Mateo Campus presenting a proposed of sales inventory management system for RPB drug pharmacy, which is presented by Condrelon Marden B, Relacruz J. Roy Cedric G, Morales Manny A. Let's proceed to the background of the study. Here are the summarized background of the study of RPB drug pharmacy. The RPB drug pharmacy allows us, the researcher to develop a sales and inventory management system which consists the following functions within the system. Point of sales, inventory management, users management. The RPV drug work pharmacy is a small drugstore that is managed by one person, the owner with his hard employees located along the highway of BF Homes, Barangay Holy Spirit, Quezon City. The business sells for a medical drug, different items or health products like a typical pharmacy store that we can see everywhere. Like some other convenience store, the business does their the physical counting of stocks and sales manually. Technically, our PVS Drugmark Pharmacy is only using a manual system that may cause to duplication of documents or work redundancy. The business is just depending on their manual listing of products and inputs of data which is possible to commit errors. Here are the objectives of the study. Our study aims to provide our PVS Drugmark Pharmacy with easier and modern alternative doing in their operation which can help to implement good and accurate system to their business. Here are some of the objectives. Number one, to create an efficient and user-friendly application. Number two, to create a database that would organize necessary details is pertaining to sales. Number three, to design, develop, and implement a sales module that will handle the sales transaction of their business. Number four, to identify the existing sales process. Number five, to provide a system that will secure important records. Number six, to develop a system that easily generates reports to the user queries. Here are the significance of the study. We intended to provide an efficient tool. The findings of this study will be beneficial to the following. First of all, to the owner. It will be effective for their business process by converting their manual process of transaction into an automated one. This improves efficiency, reduces human error, and improves the bottom line. To the pharmacies, it will be convenient to them having a computerized management system. It will lessen their workload and make easier to manage the store operations. To the customers, they will have benefits of printed receipts right after purchasing an item in case for returning and purchase concern. It will lessen their queuing time and hassle-free customer experience. To the future developers, they will inspire by the work and sincerity and to continue their dream to become a better programmer. This will serve as a basis or reference to the future researchers whose studies are related to the system. Scope and delimitation. The project scope of the system is to provide user-efficient working environment and more output can be generated through this. The system will not cover the inter enterprise's needs. The said system will help to ease only some of the difficulties of the enterprises. The system generates only reports, calculate, and adding stock and securing the data. Here are the development tools we use for the system. Our front-end technologies is developed by Microsoft Visual Studio. It's an integrated development environment from Microsoft. Our backend technology, we researcher also uses Microsoft Access 2016 to store data effectively and efficiently. Let's proceed to the presentation of sales inventory management system. We are using the admin process, Capstock admin, and our password is 1234567. Here is the main dashboard of RPV Drugmark Pharmacy Sales and Inventory Management System, which consists of the following functions and features, which is Product Inventory. In Product Inventory, we can view the store products, unit price, selling price, if it's on stock, and print, which is can be printable. We can see if their stock is critical or on stocks or out of stock. The next one is User Information. In user information, we can create or add, add stuff who can use the system. We can update their information in add new, update, and delete and edit function. We can select role, which is by manager or cashier, or admin or owner. Here is the point of sales function. In point of sales function, we can add customer, contact number, addresses, agent, product number, and searchable item code description, quantity, selling price, and on stock. Here is the sample format of our transaction. We should input, for example, customer name, 
Jackson, contact number, addresses, sales agent, and which we select add cart. Once we select add cart, we can input the item which the customer wants to purchase. For example, they want to purchase a buy blue. We should input the product number, what quantity they want to purchase. For example, one. We, and the next one we click is update. After we update, if the customer wants to add additional item, we should click add cart. Then select the item they want to purchase. For example, enter bond. Click the product number and automatically generated by the system and input the quantity they want. For example, two, then click update. After update, if they want to check out, please click check out. Then proceed for the transaction. If their cash is 100 pesos, for example, then click enter and their change is 60 pesos. Then click check out to receive the final transaction and click after that click print receipt after that for another transaction to reset the the transaction you should click new transaction and that's it after that we can see the sales view of the transaction for that selected day for example December 9 you can see the sales view of Sis Jackson for the date purchase of December 9, 2020. We can view it also in sales report, in daily sales, here is the transaction report of daily sales report from today's transaction. And also we can generate sales from monthly reports by selected date here the generated resort report for the bull monthly sales also here is the add new product for the updated state inventory management for example, if we're adding a new item, we can select add new. If the price uh, goes updated by higher or lesser, we can cl click update on every item. And we could also add quantity, add stock. And that's it, the whole function of our sales inventory management system. Thank you.